morning everyone welcome back to day three of our new york city vlogs today it is a very sunny day here in new york city we are just about to go down for breakfast we've got a different plan today and then once we've had breakfast we're going to come back to the room and i'm actually going to get ready we've just thrown some clothes on quickly because we're going to have an early breakfast and then wayne is going to come up and watch the manchester united game <laughs> it's fine it'll give me a chance to research about what we're going to do today we're doing a few things that we've never done before but we are also going to do the staten island ferry which is a must we do that every time we come and if you don't know it's a free ferry that takes you from manhattan island all the way over to the island of staten island and then it brings you back again for free it's like a commuter train but it's a ferry then we're going to see where the day takes us Never wait till. I don't know why, but I feel really hungry today. Mm. I, I feel, feel the same. Rough. I, feel, I think it's all that distance we walked. We walked a hell of a lot yesterday, didn't yeah, we? Yeah, it's, it's killing me today. Yeah. We'll take it slow today. We'll do loads of things, but we'll just take it slow, yeah? Just bear in mind if you come to New York City that it's not the most accessible place. You do have to walk a lot of places. We've got the subway, haven't you? We've got the subway as well. It's a lot of like up and down, so you mm. have to plan which stations you go to. Mm. Um, so I've had no choice really, but it just means next week I'll be paying for it. But mm. it's worth it to be back in this city. Yeah. So this morning I'm going to go for the cheddar cheese omelette with bacon and toast. Jess is going to get the American again because it is delicious I must admit. But today we're feeling a little bit exotic so I'm going to get some extra hash browns with mine today. Good afternoon everybody so we're about to leave to go to Roosevelt Island uh, we're gonna get the cable car from somewhere on 2nd Street is it 2nd Street 2nd Avenue I we're think gonna so get, gonna get the tube over and then get the 
Cable car back over. Oh, that's what we're going to do then. Sorry, so we're going to get the subway to Roosevelt Island. We're going to explore that. And then we're going to go to the smallpox hospital, which is like a derelict building, but it looks very pretty on the pictures. Then I think there's a park there as well with stunning views of Manhattan. And then we're going to grab the cable car back over into New York City, like Manhattan. And then I think we're going down to Ground Zero. And then after that, we're going to go and get the Staten Island Ferry. Or it could be the other way around, depending on what time we've got but we're going to take you with us and uh hopefully you'll see some good things in new york today i want to show everyone my jumper oh you want to show everyone your jumper yeah? yeah can you see that you might have to come a little bit closer sponsored by coca-cola no yeah. not really no <laughs> um we weren't sponsored by coca-cola we wish yeah we oh, wish right, yeah so we're, yeah we're just waiting for jess to put on her makeup the last little bit and then we're going to get done up like a plowman's lunch because it's freezing out there today <laughs> even though a lunch? Uh, it's either a dog's dinner or a plowman's lunch <laughs> but it does look very nice out there today the sun is out but we know it's freezing it's like minus eight today didn't you check last night didn't you it's gonna be minus yeah, eight, I think it's minus eight still. yeah so we're gonna wrap up warm and make our way over to roosevelt island There's the tram there on its way, as you can see. Yep, let's go. It's mild, isn't it? Ice, yeah, yeah, it's mild. It's like the UK snowy weather. Yeah. Oh, that McDonald's smells <laughs> lovely. <laughs> oh, I want McDonald's. Yeah. <laughs> Go through, go through. Yeah. 
Yeah, that's all we can film anyway. This is the Queen's Borat Bridge that we're going over. Yeah. That's a cool picture. Should we go and have a? Yeah. Should we go and get a picture of that? Yup. Get your phone out. <laughs> <laughs> oh, they've got a visitor centre, so we can check out what they've actually got here. Picture first with the bridge. Yeah. You might need to stand there. Yeah, let me give you a photo.
So we made it to Roosevelt Island and we're just about to go into the Roosevelt Island Tourist Information Centre. We know there's a small pops hospital ruins that we want to check out, don't we? Yeah. But we're still not sure what else is to do here, so we're just going to pop inside and find out what we can do. And it's chilly. It's very <laughs> chilly, yeah. That cable car was so quick and yeah. it was only $2.75 yeah. and you got some amazing views. They were blocked out by some um, yeah. beautiful Spanish Instagram one of these or Instagram yeah. as I don't know. Sorry I couldn't get right to the front of the window. I've done my best what I can but um, uh, you know if these you go things over happen. to our Instagram highlights for NYC 2022 I got some really cracking footage if you want to see it in yeah. more detail because I was right by the front and I didn't care I put my arm over someone's shoulder. <laughs> <laughs> right should we go inside and check out what we can do in the, on this island? Yeah. We are open. Let's find out what we Oh, there's like a little museum. Hi. How are you? Hey. Oh, gosh, it's cold. Yeah, I have the heat up, don't worry. Oh, yeah, don't worry. We're looking for the hospital. Oh, you want to go see, you want to go to Elmstead Park to see the small parts of the hospital? Yeah, right. Okay, well, you can go through the Cornell campus, Bloomberg Center, excellent bathroom, graduate hotel, excellent bathroom. Okay, thank Bloomberg you. Center has a cute cafe. And the same, uh, the, uh, then also you walk on the same road, uh, you're going to walk from the South Point Park towards the end is the, uh, is the Small Park Hospital Ruin and then you walk into the Fort Freedoms Park. Wow, thank you. How long walk is that? About uh, 10 minutes. 10 minutes. Okay. okay. And there's a map. Oh yeah, can I have a map, yeah. And then, then at the north end is the Lighthouse Park and we have thank the you. Belly Bly Girl Puzzle Monument, brand new. Uh, our red bus is free that goes around the island. Oh, wow. Well. Goes runs all day, so it goes from one part of the island so to the rest. You can never get lost. Could we get the bus to the hospital? Or. Uh, you could probably walk. Would it be quicker walking? Quicker walk because it stops in front at the yeah. end of the Cornell campus and then you walk into the South Point Park. Okay. Oh, thank you so much. Thanks. This lovely Swedish little sculpture. It's adorable. Thank yeah. you. Okay. Thank you so yeah. much. Thank you very much. Sign my oh, yeah. Sure. We're, um, we are YouTube vloggers. We do like we're filming for like we do travel, but for people with disabilities, just to show that you can still have like. Well, a the really islands good... has it is has a history of uh, being 100% handicap accessible. Oh wow! Okay. Uh, apartments, uh, the first apartments were accessible because we had a lot of hospitals on the island, and pe people recovered. They were independent, and and the hospital and and the apartments, you know, uh, catered to them. You know, so, and they were the first uh, to have like uh, buses that were handicap accessible as well. Oh wow! Right, right, right. Yeah, yes, yes. Yeah. Wow. That's amazing. Thank you very much. Right, right, right. Yes. Yeah, so yes, we saw the tram. Uh, we had a wonderful brand new elevator on the Manhattan side. Yeah. Okay. Uh, the buses are handicap accessible. They, they pull, uh, the 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 levers come down uh, for the ramp, and then when you get on you, with your scooter or whatever you need, we put we pull the seats up. You know, everyone's very helpful. Oh, that's um, amazing, I love that. Yeah, and then we have the ferry at the ends of uh, the baseball field, you know, uh, where um, you can catch the ferry. Is that... You can get the ferry back, can you? You can take the ferry, the ferry here, um, you can go to 34th Street, Lower Manhattan, uh, Brooklyn, you can get free trains how first. How much is the ferry? $2.75. Oh, okay, we could get a ferry back. Oh, sure, yeah. yeah. Well, thank you very much. Thank you, we'll sign a guest book. Would you like to say hello to our camera or yeah. not? Sure, I'll say hello. Okay, you can introduce yourself, yeah. thank you. Hello, hi, I'm Ellen Jacoby. I'm from the Roosevelt Island Historical Society. Welcome. We <laughs> Thank look you. forward to seeing you. <laughs> Thank you. It's a wonderful place to visit and a wonderful place to live. Thank you. Thank you very much. Would you Thank like you. Me to write down the name of our channel so you can see your little. Just write down there. Thank you. Oh gosh, what am I doing? Okay. It was really nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Can I give you the map? Yes, yes you we've did. got the map, yeah. Okay, no, yeah, yeah. It's also, I'm not sure if it's open today, um, the, the, uh, the Blackwell House, right in the middle of the island, past the, you know, at the, uh, up this road. Yeah. Yeah, I'm not sure they're, I'm not sure what's going on, if they're open, if they're not open. They okay. Never let us does this island close? So, what time does this close? We close at 4.30. Yeah. Blackwell House, if it's open, it's it's twelve to five. But we're not, I'm not sure yeah. if they're open. They don't never let because it's run by our operating corporation. They never let us know if it's uh, open or closed. So people knock on the door, and if it's open, great, you get to see it. But you can see the exterior, yeah, which is right. 
there. And if you go in, it's just basically the first three rooms. Yeah. Yeah. Would you recommend anywhere nice to eat that's not too expensive? Okay, I wasn't going to send you to uh, the Graduate Hotel. is very expensive. Yeah, no, and you we're know, on a budget. A big and budget. you know, they have a rooftop uh, bar. Oh, okay. Yeah. You know, uh, so, uh, but then you have to make reservations for that, you know, on the Graduate Hotel, Roseville Island. Hospital. Yeah. Uh, Rosen Island's, uh, you know, their website. Okay, further up the street, okay, past these apartment buildings is a fabulous Irish pub, Granny Annie's. Oh, wow, okay. Okay, good, fo good food. And then uh, opposite Granny Annie's, we have a, a Japanese cafe and an Italian cafe. And then in the middle of town, we have a diner called Nisi. Ooh. Oh, very nice. Where would you recommend? Where would you, what would you say? Would you They're all good. So it's what, whatever you, you feel yeah. like eating. Oh, so anything. I love New York food. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, well, Nisi. Nisi has Nisi has every every everything. Okay. Yeah. We'll go to a diner, I think. Yeah, Thank you. Can, if you can, don't want to, you know, it depends like what you feel like. Yeah. You did. yeah. The diner sounds nice, doesn't the it? The diner has a lot of choices. Nisi, it's next to our church in the middle of the island. You mentioned the church. Yeah. Today. Yeah. I would shake hand, but really nice. Thank you very much. Nice to meet you. Yeah. Thank you. Bye. Have a day. Okay. Bye. 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 Oh, what a lovely lady, isn't she? What a lovely lady, wasn't yeah, she? Yeah, she's really, really, really nice. informational. So the lovely lady from the visitor centre gave us this map. She also mentioned that the red bus is free all yep. around the island, but it's quicker to walk. So we are going. Hi, thank you. Want to have get my price it's on? Uh, uh, Bird is very, very good with video. Oh, no doubt. Oh, brilliant. Wonderful. Yeah. Thank you very yeah. much. Sure, very sure. Nice to meet you. Okay, take yeah. care. Thank, thank you. Much. Thank you, Ellen. What was your name again? Sorry. My Ellen. Name is Ellen Jacoby. Ellen Jacoby. <laughs> nice, nice to meet you, Ellen. Thank you. <laughs> Bye. Oh. oh. So she's just gave us a little business. business card with a lady who is the president of the Roosevelt Island Historical Society. Yeah. So we will email you Judith. Yeah. <laughs> right, let's open this map and see where we need to go. Oh, I can't do anything with these gloves on. <laughs> oh, oh, wow. wow. <laughs> okay, so we are... There. there and, and we, we want to go, go to the smallpox hospital. So she said go that way, so let's go. Yeah. So Wayne and I are massive fans of a programme called Impractical Jokers and I don't know whether you've seen the episode where Joe forfeits all of the challenges and his basically punishment is to stand on one of those. <laughs> Yeah. dressed as Captain Fat Belly and I feel so happy that I get to see it because it's one of our favourite episodes isn't it? Yeah and what does he do? What does he have to do? Suck it! <laughs> <laughs> right come on let's get to this church, uh, let's get to this hospital. So Wayne and I are stood with the most amazing view of Manhattan. It's absolutely insane and I just wanted to say I think out of all of the trips we've done to New York City, it's been the most magical, hasn't it? It's been it? brilliant, yeah. I don't know whether that's because of COVID and because we haven't actually been abroad. We've appreciated it more, I think. Yeah. yeah. And we've met so many amazing people and so we've seen so many amazing places. We've got two full days left. We do fly home at 10 o'clock on Monday night, but we're just going to relish every minute. Yeah. And we're doing something really special tonight at Times Square, which we're not going to tell you about. You'll see it later. But Wayne's really excited to show everyone. Yeah, if it, if, it happens, if it happens. I don't want to build it up and nothing happens. If it happens, I'll show you tonight, yeah. Yeah, but we've never experienced it, but it's something that Wayne's wanted to do for, say, the past, say, 12, 13 years, yeah. I think, roughly. Well, yeah. Yeah, but without me waffling on, let me just show you this fantastic view. So you've got all the way down there and then if I just span really slowly you've got the Queensborough Bridge and you can even see the Chrysler building just there and then it goes all the way down so we're going to walk along the riverfront and I think it's about a five ten minute walk and it should take us to the smallpox hospital um, and there's a big park behind it as well yeah there's a big park I don't know the history too much about this hospital but i'm sure there'll be signs on the walls but wayne um 
watched it on some YouTube Drake video. Yeah, so a few weeks before we came out here, I just typed in Google free things to do in New York or cheap things to do in New York. And I can't remember the name of the person that I watched, but it was very informative. And he said, definitely check out this place and go and visit the ruins of the smallpox hospital. He says it's, all it costs is 275 So it's not free, but it's really cheap. It's just price of a subway ticket so that's why we're here here isn't it and we've yeah. never done it before either have we so, no we never yeah. have done it so we will see you when we're at the smallpox hospital so wayne has stopped our walk because of what thing, Wayne? I've spotted some geese, so I'm gonna go and say hello to them. Come it. on then. Any wildlife or ducks? He's like, he literally is like a duck to water. Ba -bum -bum. Shh, no, that was lost. Oh, it's chillier over here. Oh. Do you think they won't pay 275 to come over? <laughs> no. <laughs> Zoom in on them. Are they Canada geese? Possibly. Do you reckon they've had to pay an extra to get over it? Yeah. Oh. Grazing. Yeah. You love a good duck shot, don't you? Well, I just love animals, full stop, don't we? We both just love animals, don't we? Any Ooh. animals that we see. Oh, here's a sign about the calf. We're getting a little bit thirsty, aren't we? We could do a, a coffee or something, couldn't we? Yeah, I was really impressed with their information about yeah, she's really good, um, yeah. disability access and stuff. Yeah, so thank you, Ellen. Ellen, was it Ellen? Thank you. Yeah. We'll go, we'll check that out later, shall we? Yeah. Maybe get a tea or an I juice. think there's a college actually, yeah. She said there's a university or a college. Cornell Tech sounds like a college. Yeah. We'll check it out later, won't we? I think that is the college. Yeah, that is the big college. It is a big oh, it's an innovation centre. Yeah. Oh, now we're going to have problems. Since I'm an innovation student, don't you know? <laughs> I've decided I'm going to take control of the camera today. Because yep, you you've not away, seen much of Wayne. I'm not good with this vlog in Malarkey, but I'm getting better if, today. Yeah. If you didn't know, I'm the one that normally does the camera action. And and you're the one that normally does all the magic on the computer. With Wayne guiding me well, next I, to it. I say what I'd like and what, what would look better, but you do actually put it on the screen, don't you? And I'm yeah. the one normally behind the camera, but... You should see that, with that behind you. Oh, that's beautiful, isn't it? <laughs> I'm so happy we've done this, so I'm so happy we came. For we're 275 and you get a cable car over? Yeah, I'm, I was saying I'm so happy that we just bit the bullet and came to New York. Because we were something and iron about it, wouldn't, wasn't we? we was, yeah. We was, unsure where we should go with all the COVID cases and everything we're thinking do we risk it do we go and we thought you know what we've got all these points on use that we've been building up over 10 years it was cheap to come over it wasn't it yeah it was yeah there was only like was it 75 pound each plus our points or something wasn't it and yeah. we're not going to get that like that again that cheap so we nope. thought let's just do it let's do it and I'm so happy and so glad that we did because as you can see we're here the only thing I've got one pet peeve yeah New Yorkers, please, please pick up your dog mess. Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> because it's everywhere. It everywhere That's yeah. the only, only thing yeah. that is driving me a bit mad. But Mind you, though, on this island, it's, it's clean, isn't it? Oh, yeah, it's really clean. Yeah. Other than the duck poo everywhere. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Seagull. Right, let's go and find this hospital. So we've just spotted, there's some of these bikes that you can hire out, kind of like Boris bikes, but they're called city bikes. And they are $15 for the day. And it says you can enjoy 30 minute rides for up to 24 hours on classic bikes. Pay only $4 for every additional 15 minutes. You get a code, you get a bike, dock your bike and you can become a member and you can also pay by card as well. So it is very, very accessible. So that is city bike. So after walking for about five minutes, we've made it to Franklin D. Roosevelt for Freedoms Park. So we're gonna walk through here and take the stroll to the hospital. But as you enter the park, there is accessible toilets just here. And there is also some normal toilets around the other side. And we're just gonna take you through and see what this park has to offer. 
It reminds me of a little bit of um, Central Park, you see, with the rocks and yeah, stuff. Absolutely. Can you see the church? That old building. Oh, yeah. That's the church. Wayne has a thing for churches, don't you? I'm not religious in any sense of the word. Not religious at all. I've got no beliefs, nothing like that. But I love going in and visiting old Gothic churches and looking at the stained glass windows and the history about them. Um, I don't know if that's a thing. I don't know, but I just like doing it. So yeah, that's what we're going to go and do now. Obviously, this is not a church. This is a hospital, isn't it? But yeah, it's very modern as well. Like these benches all look really new. Yeah. But sitting there and taking that as a view, amazing. Franklin D. Roosevelt Hope Memorial Roosevelt Island Disabled Association and there is a really really stunning picture I presume this is Roosevelt I think he was in a wheelchair and he's reaching out to a little girl who's on crutches oh what a lovely tribute what a lovely, lovely tribute. Wayne's found a sun lounger. Yeah. And it is absolutely beautiful. These That's are the most warm, comfiest benches ever. And we've got a view of, I think that's the Chrysler building just there. Yeah. Just popping up between those three buildings. Yeah, I'm not sure if he was in a wheelchair or not. I don't know. I don't know much about him to say much. I don't, really don't know too much about him, so I don't want to say too much and get it wrong. So I'll put a picture just next yeah. to Wayne. Just and, there? Yeah, just there. <laughs> Blocking the pretty view. But we have to leave these chairs now, because if we don't, we're going to take route. <laughs> so we're going to walk now to the hospital. I was just telling everyone that we had to leave those chairs because if we didn't, we was going to take root, wasn't we? Oh, look at the doggy. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, look at that. Huh? <laughs> oh, he's beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he's a little puppy. Yeah, we were going to take root. Sorry, whenever I see a dog, that's it. I'm yeah, like, not oh. whenever I see a dog, it's like, oh, doggy. I'd be, I'd be rubbish if I was a surgeon, wouldn't I? And someone bought a dog yeah. and I'd be like, sorry, I can't do your heart surgery. Yeah. So by the looks of it, I don't think you're going to be able to get in. So when I looked at it on YouTube, the person was standing inside of it. And now, I don't know if this, if this is uh, all new, because it does say structure is unstable. There's so, a little past thing here. Yeah. I don't know what but I don't know if this is a new thing or not, or it's an old YouTube video that I watched, but as you can see, it says no trespassing. So sorry about that, I thought I could actually go in. I will zoom in through the fence, just so you can see that sign. Oh, did you see that picture? No. Oh, I inside it. Okay, let me just forward this on so people can read it. There they are, I'm sorry. What were they? Are they scuttling around? I just show people the building. So this is what it did look like when it was, uh, I guess, open and that. So it is a Gothic revival structure. It was placed on the National Register of Historic Places in 1972. Mm. The but sign says it. Looks beautiful, doesn't it, when it's all there? But it yeah. looks very eerie though as well, doesn't it? Yeah, but you're an you episode can... of Most Haunted. Oh you? yeah, you can definitely tell it's like a gothic. What? There's loads of them, I don't know whether they're squirrels or... I don't whether know. they're squirrels or big giant rats. I don't know what they are. I haven't seen anything. Is there something scuttling around? Yeah, there's loads of them. Oh, uh, okay. Well, we might be able to go around the other side yet, but I mean, see if we can get anything from there. I keep seeing them, I think they're squirrels. Yeah, probably will be more likely squirrels, won't they? If you just stay here and look a minute. Yeah. We're just going to stop recording a sec just so we can just watch. Yeah.
used 